What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com, and in the last video, we took on, at the time, 24th ranked Nebraska, and it went about as expected. They just done whatever they wanted to against us, and we couldn't get anything going offensively, defensively. It was just a bad matchup all around. Not that big of a deal, but the bad part that came out of that was our starting free safety got hurt and is out for a few weeks. Now, I went ahead and simulated this week. Thankful we had a bye week, so he's only going to miss a couple more games. He's going to miss today against Central Michigan, and he should miss Rice. Outside of that, he should come back for the Troy game. We'll check the depth chart here in a minute and see what we're going to do about that situation. So we are going to take on Central Michigan today. They're B B-minus overall talent. They're 1-3. Looks like the rush defense is pretty good. Just a middle-of-the-road type of team. So we may have a chance against them. Who knows? Let's go to Sports Illustrated and check out the team information. Let's go to conference standings. If I can get to it. There we go. And here we are. We're 3-2. and two. Turner's out again for a couple of weeks. CT threw his, third, his first interception of the year. It was just... That was that weak normal play where he had an angle route from the backfield, and it was much wider than I ever expected, so I probably won't call that again. But uh, either way, he's still playing fairly well. We're still having a hard time kind of moving the ball some. We're not seeing a whole lot of cover zero to really stretch the field as much, but we're going to change some of that today, hopefully, in the playbook, which I'll show you later. Griffin is still apparently our leading rusher. I feel like he didn't do hardly anything last game, if I'm mistaken. It was like a .8. Uh, yards per rush for him. Odom's had the big day against Nebraska, if you call it a big day. But Jimmy St. Louis, you know, he's still our top guy. Just look at the defense, our backup tight end, Abdullah. Still our leading tackler. Blake Galashaw still with a couple of interceptions. We can go to the MAC and go to Central Michigan. They don't have any injuries. Now, it's been a while since I played them. I didn't even scout them. I'm pretty sure they're like a spread team and a 4-3 defense. Looks like their quarterbacks putting up some interceptions. Their leading rushers averaging almost 100 yards a game, so I'm guessing he may be an impact guy. Not much a receiver. Pretty much the rest of that doesn't tell a whole lot about them. Now, let's go to... While we're here, we can check out the top 25. Let's see, Tennessee's still on top of the board. we got a ton of undefeated teams still left. The season's halfway over with. This is our sixth game of the year, so the season is, or will be halfway over once we're done, and there's just a lot of undefeated teams still. But as you can tell, some of these teams haven't played many games yet. It's just three, you know, three games for Oklahoma, USC, you know, just four for Texas Tech. And so, see, Tennessee's already put down six games. Let's check out the Heisman Watch. Nothing really special here. Of course, none of this affects us, but I was just curious to see kind of how that's going. All right, now let's go to our playbook. Now, let's go to rosters first. Let's take care of business with our free safety situation. Let's go over here. So, our starting free safety is out for a couple weeks. We need to try to do something here. We can either let our backup tough it out for a couple weeks. We do have one freshman that's redshirting. I almost want to burn his red shirt because if you think about it, <coughs> excuse me, if you think about it, he's a much better player than Williams. He's much faster, and he's only a 62 overall. It's not like we're saving him for some amazing, you know, career at Murray State. He's not going to be that great of a ball player regardless of what happens to him. One option I did have was to have Greco. He's our number three corner, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he's our nickel back. But I want to play some nickel because I can't have my 4-3 defense out there all the time against, like, spread sets and such. So I think it's in our best interest to not have Greco play free safety the entire time. So I don't mind going ahead and burning the red shirt of this guy right here. So that's what we're going to do, and we're going to put the third string free safety right there. So true freshman Jerry Green is going to play for a couple weeks. Again, if he was much better... I would be hesitant. I'm like, I'd rather just have him register for a year and get some, you know, let his uh, ratings boost that way. But I think I'm okay with what we're doing right there. 
now that we have that out of the way, I'm curious to see if anybody's gone up. Looks like Posh, true freshman, middle linebacker, went up a couple. Usually around this time of the year is when you start seeing people go up. Here's Andrew Abdullah, our backup tight end, starter, outside linebacker. A lot of these freshmen are going up a little bit. Clark is up two points. Greco is up a couple. Odoms is up a couple. Is Odoms, yeah, Odoms is a senior. Marcus Allen's went up a couple. He's actually went up three. That's nice. Anderson even went up three. I... He can't catch the ball. He's got a 70 catch. We may try to get him a little bit more involved. I feel like I've tried my best to work around him and just try to focus on giving the ball to Clark and JSL. But let's see. DeLume. Yeah, we've had several people go up, which is pretty good. But once you get down to 50s, it doesn't really matter at that point. I was more concerned about these guys up here. And thankfully, some guys are getting better, which is good. Now let's go to our playbook here. I made just a couple of tweaks. I added back Ace Normal. I'm gonna. I have to sprinkle in some power shoot stuff just to see if we could get down the field a little bit easier. We're gonna have JSL go on go routes a little bit more. I added Ace Wide Trips. I replaced it. I replaced Ace Trips with Wide Trips because there's a, a, a power shoot kind of sort of play in this that I want to use along with it has the flat out combo it's got speed option it really fits what i'm trying to do with the offense so that's going to stay in there i twins and wishbone we're going to do something a little bit different here i had a suggestion from somebody on how to get galashaw a tad bit more involved and what we may do for like these two formations since i run exclusively from these two sets i think i may put galashaw a halfback and just go to the outside all the time that's what I use him for. I never go up the gut with either one of these. So I may just try to get him to the outside, use his speed, and see if that works or not. Otherwise, I'm not going to put him hardly anywhere else because we need him rested on the defensive side. We need him over there more than we need him on offense. Everything else is the same in terms of formations. Now, I did not fool around with any of the audibles. I don't think I'll have to use them much. So with that being said, let's go ahead and take on... Central Michigan. All right, nobody's in trouble again. I kind of wish, let's just talk about this while we're here. We haven't had anybody get in trouble this year. If we go to coach ops, no, it, maybe it's rosters. Eh, dang it, come on. There we go. Let's go to rosters and go to program standards. I wish over time... You know, if you're not going to get anybody, if you don't see anybody in trouble, I wish that bar would go down a little bit more over time instead of just sitting there. From what I can tell, that bar hasn't been moved any this year. I feel like if nobody's getting in trouble, the NCAA shouldn't get onto us so much. But I, I could be dead wrong on that. Either way, it'd be nice if some guys would kind of get in trouble, at least players that don't play a whole lot. That way we can lower this bar and use those points somewhere else. But it looks like it's not moving. And we and it will not move until we do something about that in terms of somebody getting in trouble and over-discipline them if we can. But nobody's in trouble today, so we'll have to do that at another time. Looking at their stats here, again, that's just an emulator thing right there. Uh, we already kind of checked out their main studs. Their middle linebackers got some decent amount of tackles so far, just through four games. All right, we got a pretty day for some football. I want the ball to start the second half. Now, we're going to go to formation subs first. I'm going to leave that as is. I'm going to leave that as is. Here, I'm going to leave it as is. Here's what I'm going to change. I'm going to reset the current. And I'm going to, instead of put Odoms, I'm, we're going to use this to see if we can get Gallish all the outside. Now, some people may think this is kind of cheese, but I'm only using it just trying to get him to the outside quickly because right now it's kind of tough for him to throw it to him in that way because he, he can't catch all that well. And I'm not a big fan of a lot of like the wide receiver reverses. So we're going to do like a lot of basic option sweep type stuff for him right there. And the same for this right here. So we're going to go and put him right here, and maybe that'll help. Otherwise, you're not going to see him on offense. He's going to be out there exclusively just to get to the outside. Maybe we can use that. I'm okay with that. Let's put 
let's put Griffin there as well since we had Odom's and a couple other spots. We're going to use the tight end sub package there. I like what I'm doing there. And we're going to use the tight end sub package there. I got him on a lot of these. Let's go put Odom's there. So let's see Odom's, Griffin, Griffin. Let's put Odom's here. I'm just trying to see. Now let's do Odom's here and Griffin there. It, it doesn't really matter. They're both pretty much the same player. Okay, let's check out Central Michigan's roster. They got a starting quarterback at 74 overall, but only 59 speed. We're going to try to go after him if possible. I think for some reason, I just completely forgot to do any zone blitzing on Nebraska, but I don't think they showed us. I, I like the zone blitz when they got like a hanging tight end out there. I think it just works a little bit better than going up against, you know, an empty set or just no tight ends on the line. But we're definitely going to go after this guy for sure. And they got an impact running back. So this is going to be maybe a nightmare scenario for us. 91 overall. I mean, what do you do about that? Uh, we'll try to stop him, though. Uh, free uh, Fullback, nothing special. They got an impact wide receiver, so maybe they will be a little more balanced. I don't know. We'll see about that. But he looks like a pretty good player. Decent tight end. Catch, 68. 84, 74, 80, 82, 74, just your typical Mac line, I guess. Like I said, I think they run a 3-4, or a 4-3, sorry. This is a decent-sized defensive end, 85 and 76 on the ends. Yeah, this guy's pretty small, and they got a lot of defensive tackles, so they do run a 4-3. Outside linebacker, they got an impact outside linebacker right there. And their leading tackler, I think was this guy, if I'm not mistaken. It's one of these two guys. I don't remember. Corners, not bad. They got some several guys in the 80s. Nothing special at free safety. Strong safety, nothing special there. They got an average kicker and an average punter. All right, let's get this show on the road. Love to get a win here. Now, let me make sure I have... Audio. I have that the normal. One thing I, I'm going to leave that at eight. Let me know if that's like too loud. During the game, I, I went back and watched a little bit of the Nebraska game, and I felt like the noise, the gameplay noise, I guess the game volume itself was a little high. But if you think it's okay, you can still hear me pretty easily while I'm playing the game. That's great. If not, I can easily lower this. Sometimes it's just kind of hard to tell if it's too loud on my end. All right, we're going to do that. Do a high kick. And he was going to take it out, do something with it. Now, they're going three wide. I'm going to do a 4-3-1 high. I think they're going to run the ball quite a bit. And, dang it, I called the wrong play. I don't know what's happening here. I must have called the wrong play. Either that or done an audible. <laughs> I completely messed something up there. Uh, let's try quarters. I'm really scared about this running back. Good stop there. That was a horse collar. I don't think they called that back in the day. <laughs> All right, let's go with a 4-4. Third and two. They're going with the big set, so I'm assuming they're going to run. Now, let's leave it at his and see what happens. Good stop. We'll take it. And we got a player hurt, Tim Royal, one of our defensive tackles, if I'm not mistaken. Hopefully, it's nothing too serious. Uh, we let's just do middle fan. I don't think we'll be able to do much return possibilities here. I think we're just not gonna have a lot of room. I could be dead wrong, but let's just play it safe. Hopefully that'll go in the end zone. Just enough. Good deal. Now what we can do out of the gate is try to 
give Galashaw the ball. Let's see what happens. Oh, he's out for two weeks. That was really quick. So let's look at that. Injuries are not helping us right now on the defensive front. So he's out. And we got, he's only out for a couple weeks. I mean, I don't have anybody I, I can unred shirt and put in here. So it is what it is, I'm afraid. Now, what we may try to do is a little bit more 3-4. Since I don't like these guys right here all that much, they're just not going to do a whole lot for us. But we got a middle linebacker that's a whole lot better than any of our backup defensive tackles. So I'll try not to forget we'll do some basic 3-4. What worries me, I don't know if we could do that today because I don't know if the 3-4 just, I don't think it does a really good job of stopping the run. But we could try it. Today may be a good test to do that. Now, they're shifting hard that way. Just get him involved in the offense a little bit. I'm okay with that. Now, let's pick a play. Let's go cross in. Or going man. Second and three. I don't know. This is basically for Jimmy St. Louis, but I don't know if... Yeah, it's not a bad little three-yard play. I, it's much better against zone. We can go back and look at that. I didn't know how many yards against man this drag route would have. But it, it, it turned out okay. He ended up going about five yards deep on it. So we got the first down, which is good. Let's do tunnel screen. We're going man. We may have a chance to go over the top here. We can do that. Get Griffin going. Not bad there. So we're moving the ball halfway decent. Let's do a flat out. And then we'll run the ball. Yes, we're going to do curl flat. We're going zone, so we'll just probably go to JSL just to keep it safe. I'd rather him touch the ball than anybody else. Not the best throw, but we get the first down. He kind of had to reach for it. I don't know if you noticed that. Now what we could do is stay in this formation and go speed option. We're going zone 4-3. I may go to the left. <laughs> that was pretty obvious. I may... Let's motion him over. Maybe we can get a better blocker. Let's just cut up field and don't fumble it. I probably could have pitched it, but they were going zones. So I'd rather just go up field and pick up a little bit easier yardage. Now, I want to go second and three. Let's... Where's it at? Let's do wide receiver deep post. We're going man. So what we're going to do here is either go to Clark over the top or Jimmy St. Louis on the right. To bring in both safeties. Can he make a play? Ah, he dropped it. What do you do about that? <laughs> I, it's so funny. I got to stop and say that. Somebody caught me. It was in the last game. I've been saying that a whole lot during this game. You know, what do you do? You know, when, you, when there's nothing you could do about a particular play. I got to work on that, or I could just leave it as is, and that could be my calling card. But either way, I thought it was funny somebody caught that. All right, it's third and three. I'm going to go back to, I mean, the flat out. Uh, no, let's, uh, yeah, let's just go, no, let's do, let's do cross in instead. It's two down territory for us. Now they're going zone here. He should be able to get more open. On this play. Hopefully. Nope, not even close. So, what we need to try to do here is fourth and two. Uh, I'm a little worried about this. I feel like we got to pass it. I just don't trust our run game. Now they're going zone. What worries me here is, I don't know, hopefully Abdullah can make this catch. And it's a terrible throw by CT. So that's, I guess that's my fault. I should have thrown the ball. I should have ran the ball or something. That's okay. I feel like we've moved the ball fairly well on that drive. We probably, somebody gets stopped there. Okay. Second down. 
I'm going to take a chance. We're going to go zone blitz. If I was them, I'd still run it. But we're going to try to go after this guy. Good stop. Good deal. Now, did I just see something there? Let's go back and look at this. Well, look at that. We got a true freshman as an impact player. That's awesome. If you remember at the beginning of the season, we only had two impact guys. Gallishaw and JSL. Now we got a true freshman middle linebacker, which is great. I'm all for that. All right, let's get another stop here. Oh, that should have been picked. Oh, that was close. Either way, we stopped it. All right, let's get the ball back. Let's see if we can actually finish a drive this time. That'd be great. Gallishaw has some room here. Nah, maybe not. I thought we had more room than I thought. Let's try... Tight end streaks. We're going zone. It's one of our parachute plays. Again, we got to take our shots downfield if they let us. Get about six yards there. Not too bad. Let's try direct with Odoms. They're going man nickel. I don't know who's on who. Ooh. Thank you, we'll take it. Face mask. That was good defense by them. We just lucked out on the face mask. We can try to get Galashaw going again. We're going man. I forgot that linebacker's going to be on that side. We'll still go in that direction. Eh, just not much there. That's good defense. Trying to think, what haven't we called? Let's go. I want to go. We're gonna do. We're gonna add a little bit of shallow stuff. That was another suggestion I had. So we're gonna try some of that. Let's go halfback streak. We're going zone. This will probably go to JS Sale. I could try to. Yeah, they're going basic cover, too. Good catch by Galshaw. I didn't know if he was going to catch or not. It went basic cover, too, and I had time to throw it. So that was a good play there. We could try. I want to try basic slam. I just feel like we can't do much basic runs and with this offense just because our offensive line isn't all that good. But we'll try it here. not a whole lot there, especially in the inside. He's gassed. He looks gassed across the board. Let's go back here, and we're going to try wide receiver drag, and that's the end of the quarter. All right, not much happened there. I feel like we probably could have got a touchdown out of it, but we didn't, but that's okay. Let's do another shallow. We're going man. This will probably go to JS Sale. I almost got sacked. We can look at this right here. They brought great pressure from the outside. Nobody picked him up. My halfback couldn't pick him up. And I should have went underneath. I should have done this. I should have went up there, and I didn't. That's okay. Thankfully, we got the ball off just in time. So what are we? Are we 31? Uh, let's do a toss play. We'll run the ball. And then if we can't go for... I mean, I can attempt a field goal, but I just don't think we can. <laughs> I'm afraid to go this direction, but they're blitz on that side. I didn't get it! I knew he wouldn't get it. I knew he wouldn't get it. Okay, let's... 
I, I don't trust the run game to get that yard. So I got to go curl flat and you know, they're going man. Ah, this, this worries me. Hopefully he can make this throw. Interception. Dang it. Terrible. Okay, I'm stopping with that. No more. That's two fourth down pass plays that CT just can't make. So, okay. Dang it. So, I guess I should run in that. I, yes, I could kick a field goal, but I just don't trust my kicker to do much of anything there. I, well, I mean, we were close to it, to the, close enough to get a field goal, I guess, but my kicker's terrible. And I'm not a very good kicker, so that's a bad combo. Wow, what do you do? Look at this. Easy first down there. We'll try a zone blitz. I just hate going right down the field twice like that. Can't score either time. It's a good hit there by our impact linebacker. We'll do quarters. Make good decisions. Ooh, thankfully he overthrew that because he was open. Third and ten. We'll go back to Cloud. Love to get a stop here. He's got all day to throw. This worries me. Dang it. You just take your chance there. One-on-one on one situation. Oh, you got to be kidding. Look at this. I was in perfect position. Look at this. I, it's whatever. That's what we deserve for not being able to score points on our last two drives. Ah, uh, that kills me. I knew that's who he was going to. He was wide open. That arrow route's pretty good against man if you can make the throw, but gosh. Way too easy of a drive. We got to figure out what to do on offense. Defense, I'm not worried about. I think they played well enough for us to win today. But our offense, the last, I mean, all year has just been an awful struggle to get anything going. And I don't know what to do about it, but we'll figure it out. Let's go. I'm just trying to think, looking at my stuff here. Let's try speed option from trips. We're going zone nickel. Come on, Griff. Get to the line. Taking forever. Good run there. We can try direct again. Hopefully we can get a first down. I don't know why I'm rushing it, but I'm not really worried about the clock. What's going on? Somebody blocked. Nobody blocked on him. Look at that. Just way too easy. Now I have to throw. Oh, man. I have to. I have third and five. I, we'll go half back out. That was my first guess, but they're going zone. If they go basic cover two, I may try to go to JSL here. And they are. But... I, I couldn't get at the JSL in time. I was fixed to get sacked. My left tackle got beat pretty bad. So I had to run for my life. Let's try basic power. We're going zone 4-3, so I may actually let Galishaw run this one to the right. Good play there. Ah, man, one more juke could have done it. It's a good play, though. we got plenty of time. 
let me think here. Let's go back to tight end streaks. We're going zones. We'll go back to Clark. Bring him over. Get the first down there. Let's see. I got so many defensive players playing offense. It's ridiculous. Let's do speed option. We'll do it from the gun. We're going zone 4-3. We'll probably just run to... Hmm. Let's bring him over and see if that helps anything. Griffin feels so slow. We get five yards out of it, though, which isn't bad. Let's do a Tosh to Galashaw and see if he can get something going. Probably Mr. going with Nickel. That doesn't help a whole lot. And they're doing that. At least we can make it a little bit easier. Good play there. That's going to help us a little bit. Just get some speed to the outside. We're, we're not going to have that problem next year. I don't think he's. it'll show on the depth chart. But Drummer, he's our transfer from Duke, if I'm not mistaken. He's got 93 speed. We're going to do a lot of outside stuff with him next year. Plus, no, and he can catch. 68 catch. So we're going to do a lot of stuff out of the backfield with him, for sure. But we can't do that this year because he's a transfer. I'm trying to think what I haven't called. We haven't done much RPO stuff. They're going man 4-3. I don't know who's on who. He's coming down. That's, yeah, that was a bit of a buggy type of play there. We're going to do a speed option from Ace Wide Trip. You're going man nickel. I feel like we have no choice but to go to the right. Just to get away from that impact guy. Let's just get a first down. Be done with it. Don't make it too difficult. Let's just go back to power. I'm not really ready to run the halfback option just yet. We're going zone 4-3. It looks like i got to go back to the right again. Good block there. Good deal. We'll take it. So that was a smart move. Thank you, Isaiah, for that suggestion. Just get some speed to the outside. Now, again, some people may think that's cheese, but when you're so bad, you got to come up with something on, you know, to get the muster up some points, some yards, anything. And we're playing him just enough where he's in the on the field every two or three plays. All right, good deal. Let's get back on defense. Now, our defense will probably give up a couple more touchdowns today. They got a decent little offense. Impact receiver, impact running back. Do another high kick. He's going to fair catch it. I'm all for that. But going four wide, what we can try to do is try like a three, four quarters. We'll go between that and nickel. Just to break it up some. Easy first down there. That was a good hit. Way too easy for a first down. Let's try quarters from Nickel. They got a pretty good quarterback. He's doing whatever he wants to at the moment. Oh my gosh, there he goes. Somebody stop him. Went right by me. We'll go defensive line there. We'll just stick with quarters from Nickel again. Play action. Make a play, Galashaw. Good defense. He made up for for the big play he gave up earlier. Second and ten. Let's go back to quarter of the three four. 
just to help our nickel because we'll probably have to go nickel on third down. He still caught that somehow. So it's what, third and five? I don't, I mean, we'll try clown, but it being third and five, I can see him go either way here, run or pass. All day to throw, all day to throw, wide open. Good defense, shoot! He was wide open. He got over there just in time. I'm afraid to bring extra blitzers. Now, this will be a heck of a kick, and their, their kicker's not all that great. He'll probably nail it. Get down. No, wait. No, perfect kick. <laughs> he had an extra 15 yards on it. Well, that's better than a touchdown. So, we've got 38 seconds. What I may do is... Oh, we'll just see how good this return is. Not a whole lot there. We could try one more run with Galashaw. And eh, they're going dime, though. It's not going to work. <laughs> and they got their player on the opposite side. Let's just... I'm going to wait. Let's see if those guys move anymore. Sometimes those... When they go dime against us, they may move. But it looks like they're not going to. Get out of bounds. Might as well. All right. So we... We got 29 seconds. We can try to get down the field if we can. I'm trying to think of ways to get... And they keep going zone against this play. So we'll probably have to go to Clark. I got all three timeouts. I probably could have gotten the first, but we'll just go ahead and get out of bounds. Let's do a... Drag, they're going man, and they're bringing they're doing that. Now, I may have to call a timeout after this one. Oh, no, 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 no. That's all. We got to go back and look at this. We got to learn something here. I thought JSL was going to be pretty open, but they had a spy. He was the one who done that. That's great defense. That's what happened. So that's my fault. So it's third and one. I am, let's run it. Third and one. They're going, Ball now watch me not get this and they'll call a timeout. Of course I didn't get it and they're going to call a timeout. Nope, they're going to let the clock roll. So what we're going to try to do, let's just go for this right here. Five, four, let's just go for a Hail Mary. Make a play. Ah, oh, it's a good try. All right, we're down a field goal. I feel like we should be up, but that's our fault for not scoring those first couple of drives because we're moving the ball pretty well. We just can't finish. Looks like 15 to 16, we're pretty balanced in the yards as well, which is pretty odd. They are throwing more than they're running, which I'm okay with. I think that'll help us stay in the game. That one turnover, that's just a bad throw by CT. Everything else I'm okay with. So let's see if we can play better in the second half. Central Michigan will be off to start the We're going to need to. Gellishaw kept us going a little bit on that dry, on that uh, first half. I'm going to let him take this one out. See if we can... Not a whole lot there. Let's try this cross in again. They're going zone. We'll go back to JSL. Hopefully he can get open. We'll give Galashaw a bit of a break. No yardage whatsoever. Barely two yards, if that. Let's go tunnel screen. Please go man. Yes, they're going man. Hopefully we can get a first down here. They're bringing both safeties. I have to go over the top. I had just two terrible throw. 
That's all that was, just a terrible throw. So it's third and eight, it's not what we want. But you deal with it. So they're going man. And what worries me is I'd love to go to Anderson, but he probably can't make that play. Or it could be intercepted like that. Terrible throw. Terrible, terrible throw by CT. Dang it, CT, you're going to lose us the game. Look at this, just terrible. Uh, just, I'm not even going to look at it again. What's the point? We're going to lose the game, I swear. Maybe I just need to run more and just... I just, I mean, we had to try to go for the third down. I thought it was in our best interest to... Look at this. I, I thought it was in our best interest to try to get the first down, <laughs> but CT just made a terrible throw. Uh, I, I hate that I'm putting my defense in a bind all the time. It feels like I am. Uh-oh. Outnumbered. Thankfully, it was a bad throw. Okay. Third and six again. Man, if we could just hold them to a field goal, that would be a miracle. All day to throw. I don't, uh, I, yeah, it just, it is what it is. I can't blitz. They'll just get, I mean, they'll just throw it quicker. Instead, if they was going three wide. Why? Mm, never mind. I'm just going to get more upset. I hate when they do that. I don't. Instead, if they was going three wide and they went goal line. So I prepared accordingly. Well, we got to have another second half comeback like we've done all year. Eh, what a disappointing game. Shouldn't be like that, but it's life. Now my defense is playing terrible. We got to do something offensively. I don't know. Just all you. I know I got no talent on offense, but it's just been an absolute struggle. I, I'm having a hard time out scheming and my bad offense. There's nothing there. And he's gas, so I can't throw it to him. Let's do speed option from Ace Normal. They're going man nickel. Now they decide to go man on that formation. And they decide to... Dang it. I'm going to go left anyways. I don't have an audible for it. Dang it! Ah! What in the world's going on? I mean, nothing's going right. Everything's... It's always the third quarter. It all falls apart. Now we're not going to get any yards here. Oh, you got CT. Please make a better throw. I'm at a loss for words. It's at a point where just the game's over. I feel like, they, I mean, we're not going to have any chance here. And this is a bad play. I'm calling a timeout. We're not going to get a first down on that. I don't know what to call. Right, let's try trips over version. We're going zone. Problem is, Anderson's probably going to have to catch this unless they something goofy happens. Ah! Well, all right, I'm not giving up on the game, but I feel like the game's just, just nothing, just nothing's going right. It's all for them and nothing good for us, so it's going to be just another loss. We're going to have to get super lucky on fumbles because offensively, just nothing's working, and I don't know what to do about it. I guess we got to run the ball more. I guess we'll just go go straight to the run game and just... Because CT, if he can't even make the basic throws, then we have no chance. And here we go. Here comes the running back. Gain of 10 on the play. First and 
10. Ball on the 37 yard line. The problem is you don't have the running backs to run with. It's all kinds of bad. Ah, oh, why can't we pick that one off? I mean, it was right there. We still couldn't pick it off. Something's good. It has to go away. At least one play. One positive play. Anything. Third and ten. We have to get a stop here. I'm afraid. We're going to do Clad one more time, but I may be wasting my time on it because if he's going to just sit back there and throw. Pick that off next time. I mean, don't. I mean, I'm glad you've done that, but still. And look what happens. Fourth and ten, they're going for it. I'm going to go back to Clad. That's the only thing I trust. All day to throw, all day to throw. Please go out of bounds. Thank you. <sighs> They're not making it easy, that's for sure. Let's see if we can get Galshaw get one run under his belt before he gets too gassed. Please go to the end zone. Ah, dang it. It's a good play, though. We'll take it. He still looks a bit gassed. Let's try a speed option from here. To... Ah, they keep going man when I run, but they always go zone on this formation. I'm not worried about the time. That doesn't concern me. Just, just let him keep it. I don't think we got the first. Of course we didn't. Let's try another run play. We're going zone 3-4 this time. That, oh, now everybody's just going up. We're going to have to just get the first. Just go straight up and be, get, be done with it. Let's try power again. We're going zone, but yeah, I feel like i got to go to the right. Just get away from that impact guy. And we're going to let Galshaw get a touchdown again. Might as well. All right, we're back in it somehow. Thankfully, the fullback nudged that linebacker just enough for Galshaw to get out there. So that tells you speed kills. If you got speed, use it however which way you can. I feel like that's the only thing that's been kind of working, though, is just outside stuff with Galshaw, but... You got to make it work. Because right now, I don't trust CT. He's just, oh, like, you can go back and look. And he may have a positive. No, it's still nothing. Nothing for him. He's made some terrible throws today. So maybe we just need to rely on the running game. Let's get back on defense. Try to get another stop. Fair catch made on the kickoff. Let's go zone blitz. Don't run up the middle. Oh, come on. That's the perfect play call. You just take a chance on that situation. Run up the middle on my zone blitzes. Or run away from it. Get a few yards there on the little out route. Uh, I, I really wanted to go 3-4 there, but I can see him running it. They're going gun ace twins. What worries me is... Nope, we're going to do that. Thankfully he overthrew that. 
All right, third and seven. We're going to try Cloud Cloud. Worked for us on the last drive a couple of times. And I just got destroyed. That's why you get tall corners to do that right there. So we got to stop. Our defense is holding up their end of the bargain. Our offense has to help them out. So let's try to get another touchdown here if we can. We'll fair catch that. Don't fumble it. We're in the middle of the field. I want to go back. Let's do a speed option for this formation. We're going man 4-3. Well, I feel like I have no choice but to go to the right. Even though the shift, I don't want to get near that linebacker. I felt no need to pitch it there. I just didn't see a whole lot of room to work with. All right, let's see if CT can make this throw. We're going to go back to a flat out. We're going zone. We'll go with the JSL, see if he can pick up some yardage. Terrible throw. Man, that was a terrible throw. He had to come back five yards just to get it. I'm going to run the ball. I don't trust our passing game to get the five yards. So we're going to give this to Galashaw and see if he can make a play out of it. I'm not going to let him get hit. So let's just get the first thing. I'll be done with it. All right, let's see if we can give CT another simple throw. We're going to tunnel screen. They're going man, but they're going die. Dang it, this is not its not going to work. And they're shifting all that way. You better hope they go cover zero, and they're not. And that's, dang it, that's just perfect defense. That's what you're supposed to call on that play. Let's go back to halfback power. Let's just go back to running gets. I don't we're going zone, and they got the linebacker on that side still, so we're going to have to go to the right. Get some of the yards back. He's still gassed. Uh, I'm going to run the ball. I don't trust the passing game. I really don't. They're going man nickel. I like what I see if everybody just holds on. We're going to go to the left. I almost got sacked. If you go back and look, this my left guard got blown up. Right there. I honestly thought I was going to get sacked. We got the first down, though. Let's do a cross in. Let's see if he can make this simple throw. They're going zone. This is going to go to JS Sale. His best throw of the day. <laughs> At least it felt like it. All right, good deal. All right, let's go back to Galashaw. We're going man. I'm going to hurry up to the line. The ship looks okay. Just get the first down. Let's go back and give... Him CT a simple throw. They're going man. Finally, they decide to go man. Now let's. Now I'm not worried about the clock. We're in a groove, so let's just go. Terrible throw. Let's go back and run a speed option. I don't. We can't go up the middle in any way. They're going man nickel. Oh, that shift is terrible. Uh, no, let's uh, let's just run to the right. Ooh, not a big fan of this. That's just bad play all around. Bad, bad play. Third and nine. 
I'm gonna go back and run, get back to Galshaw. This is two down territory for us anyways, now, but they're going nickel. So I'm not a big fan of that corner just sitting all the way over there. It looks like we got no choice. But we're getting the first down out of it. Give it to your speedster, let him do his thing. Now he's really gassed, we gotta give him a break. CT is gassed. Let's go tunnel screen. They're going nickel. This probably ain't gonna work again. So what I may have to do, I have an idea. To help him out. We're gonna bring him over. There we go, that helped a little bit. Get the first down. So what I've done here, I motion Abdullah over because I want, technically, I want that impact linebacker to be on Griffin. That means he's got more field than he has to run to chase him down. If I would have left Abdullah over there, this guy probably would have been on our running back, which means he would have had less room. He didn't need as much field to make the play. So I brought him over and forced a defensive switch up. All right, let's go direct, man, nickel. The clock is stopped. Now I'm at a point where I'm kind of thinking about the clock. Terrible play. They went to the outside. I can't go to the out. Ooh, I probably could have. My right tackle blocked pretty well. Number five on the run. No gain on the play. Everybody is gassed. I mean, just like everybody. Uh, let's go curl flat. We're going man. Going dime. I don't... Hmm. Yeah, I just... I didn't want to throw it. I don't trust CT to make that throw. Uh, we would have got it picked off again. So it's third and eight. We're going back to what we know best. We're going man, we're going nickel again. Let's see how they shift. Ah, uh, geez, that's all kinds of bad right there. I may call a timeout. Let's call a timeout and regroup. I don't like any of that, so I want to use a timeout. We're going to let the clock run while we do it. And if we don't convert this, we'll kick a field goal. Let's go backfield. And they're going nickel again. They're smart. That's smart to stop that. Because they say they're doing the exact same thing. I swear, they went back to the exact same setup. I got no choice but to go left. Ah, you ain't going to get it. Dang it! I got to kick a field goal. Got no choice. Please make this. I don't... Thank you. All right, we got something out of it. All right, we tied it up. Now our defense is playing great. Hopefully they can get another stop so we can get back on offense and maybe we can seal this thing. But we got to score in order to do it. Now we've been struggling to do that today. Been struggling to do that all year, unfortunately. Go quarters. Out of nickel. I think I may have caused that incompletion. I kind of bumped into both of those guys and kind of delayed the route somewhat. Now we're going to try zone blitz. If I was them, I would run the ball here big time. I want speed option. Good stop. All right, third and long. We're going to go back to cloud. It, it, it was terrible in the first half, but it's working great in the second half. So let's just stick with it. He's definitely going to throw. All day to throw. Ah, dang it! Let's go with a one high. I need to run some 3-4 to help our offensive line a little bit, but nothing's really presenting itself to do so right now. 
just a bad throw there. He may have got hit when he threw it. I couldn't tell. We'll try another zone blitz. I don't know if it's been working. I can't really tell. I mean, I haven't been able to get to him. Thank you. We got to him. That was a weird, goofy sack. He didn't. He kind of ran into him. <laughs> kind of, sort of. I don't know. It was weird, but either way. Third and forever. Good stop. Punt the ball. Our defense has stepped up. Uh. Let's do a double cross. We may have enough room. If the kick is high or to the right, we may have a chance to return it. If not, we'll just fair catch it. Block that guy, somebody. Nope. Nobody blocked him. So we're on the left hash. Gallishaw's gas. So I'm going to let him breathe a little bit. Let's do cross in. We're going, man. I'd love that they bring both safeties. There's two minutes to go. And this ain't going to work. And we got some yards out of it. Second and six. He's still gassed. Let's go speed option. They're going zone four, three. Clock has stopped. Just nothing. Absolutely nothing. I don't trust our passing game, so I'm gonna run the ball. I don't know what else to do at this point. And their course are going dime. They're just gonna every time we call this formation, they're gonna spread it out. I got no choice but to go to the right though. I didn't get it! Dang it! Dang it! Ah, oh, we got a punt. I don't trust it. Gosh, I should have dove, I guess. I don't know, but just enough for them to get the fourth on us. Please fair catch it. Oh, what a crazy game and not in a good way. And I feel like it's just if our offense could have mustered up anything today. Pick that off next time. Good defense, though. Okay. Let's go quarters at a 3 4 this time. Gives me a chance to give our defensive line a bit of a break. Good defense there. Got a hand on it. Third and ten. Can we get a stop? If we get a stop here, then then we'll have no choice but to start passing on the next drive. All day to throw. Good defense, though. Woo! We're going to middle fan on this one. So we got a minute and a half. Can we get down the field and score? I don't know. We'll try. <laughs> I don't trust CT the rest of the day, but he's got to throw some to give us a chance. We're in the middle of the field. Everybody looks gassed. Let's run the ball. We're going to go halfback direct. Just get to the sideline. We're going zone. They'll probably move to the right, and they are. I snap. Dang it. Dang it. What do you... Uh, we're going man. I have him doing that. And we're about to get beat. We're about to go to overtime. 
We're going zone here. I am going to let the clock. I'm not going to try to get a first down here. I don't think we have enough time. Our offense isn't good enough to just get down their field really quick. So we're going to let this clock run. And if we convert, get a first down, we'll just go to overtime. Because right now, I just don't have any faith in us getting down the field that quickly. That gives them less time to make a play if needed. Oh, my gosh. Good play. Big play right there. Let's call a timeout. Somehow, okay, we're out of timeouts. Let's do curl flats. Now we're, we're going zone. Can we get down the field and do something at this point? Good play there. On the 45, we're going to call the same play. We're going zone. Stay zone. By all means, keep going zone on me. We're going to go back to JS Sale. I always find it interesting they've got their big linebacker. Oh, my gosh. Got to hurry up to the line. I don't have any timeouts. He didn't get out of bounds. Get to the line. Let's go, JSL. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Go. Go. Oh, no. Okay. One second. I had to get out in time. Let me show you what I've done right here. I wasn't going to be able to get the touchdown. So, they went man. I thought they went zone. So, I threw it to the wrong guy. Thankfully, the guy dove for it. So, we're able to make a play here. The guy bounces off JSL. No, there's like three seconds to go. I cannot get a touch. I don't think I could have gotten a touchdown. I may have, but I didn't want to run out of time. So I ran out of bounds on purpose. Now, if we mess up this field goal, then you can yell at me later. But but that's what I've done. I don't, he's too slow. I think he would have got caught. All right, fingers crossed. Game over! Go to the house! Yeah! Ah! Woo! Oh my gosh! Crazy, crazy, crazy! Oh, I had to run out of bounds. Go, you have to go back and look at that play, but I don't think he was going to get the touchdown. I think somebody was going to catch him, and we would have lost the game because there was like one second left, and I, ha I just feel like I need to get out of bounds to figure out what to do next. That one made the number two list. Oh, gosh. I, I want to celebrate, but my head hurts too much. So, okay, the offense done really well. The big thing was the rushing. Gala Shaw putting him the way we did, that helped a ton. So we're going to stick with what we're doing. Anytime I can get 400-plus yards with this bad of talent, I'm going to stick with it. Big thing is, let's see, we didn't even get sacked, did we? We ran the ball a ton of that second half. We had to. CT just couldn't get it going. But the big drive, I mean, was obviously the last drive. Again, I just felt like I had to get out of bounds in that situation. I think he was going to get caught before he was going to score, and we'd had to go into overtime. I didn't want to do that. We won. That's all that matters. We can check out here. 20 of 32. Now, just looking at that, it looks really good. That's a good percentage because I'm giving him easy throws, but he had some terrible interceptions to go along with that. Gashaw had 178 yards rushing. We'll continue to do that just to get his speed on the outside. Jimmy St. Louis, 13 receptions, 97 yards. I wish he would have got a touchdown, but it just didn't work out. He could have had one maybe. I, again, I just don't think he would have scored towards the end there. Our offensive line can't pick ink anybody. And everybody and their brother kind of got a tackle on defense. So, okay, let's get out of here. Hmm. Jeez. I don't even know who we have next. I think it's Rice. That's going to be... Rice is going to be interesting. They run a crazy option offense. Yes, they got one of the top rushing attacks in the country, but they're one and three. That's going to be interesting to see how we handle that. We're going to run a lot of one high in that one. So, come on back. We'll take on the Owls of Rice, and I'll talk to you later.